Drew Holiday, let's get straight to it. Drew Holiday feels very strongly about retiring in two years after his contract is up. God damn. <laughs> Not Jimmy beat that niggas mentally and physically. Jesus Christ. And Tatum. Tatum sent him home too last year, you know what I'm saying? But like, damn, that's more like that. Jimmy Butler just like really just mind fucked him. And then now he's like com contemplating retirement. That's next level uh, savagery, I can't lie. But Andrew Hart is a great player, you know what I'm saying? Just didn't show up this uh, playoffs. Even though, you know, he had some dull moments in the playoffs with this year and last year as well. And even the year before that, too. That nigga caught, went missing some games, too, in the buck, uh, the, when the Bucks went on that little weak fluke run. But, you know, it's cool. No one ever said that, though, but, you know, it's all right. That, that run was so flaky. So flaky, but... um. No, Drew Holiday's a great guy, and you know, I don't want to like bash on him too much, you know, all the donations he makes. But goddamn, I'm never, I wouldn't admit this. I'm just gonna retire like quickly. <laughs> I, I'm just retiring silently on some Tim Duncan shit. I would never just announce I'm contemplating retirement after getting beat in the first round and getting dicked down by Jimmy Butler. I'm sorry, <laughs> that could not be me. <laughs> shit, shit. Oh my God, that's a mental warfare for him. Holy, but uh, he did pick up the win today, you know. Kevin Love throwing touchdown passes. Uh, Jimmy made some plays. Oh, not some plays. You know, Jimmy did his thing. You know what I'm saying? Um, shout out to the Heat. It's going to be a sweaty ball series between the Heat and the uh, Knicks. Just pure sweats on both sides. You know, the Miami Heat are just a team full of sweats. That's why I said the Celtics or the Bucks didn't want to see them in the first round. They're just too sweaty. And the Knicks are just full of sweats with Thibodeau. So, you know, it should be a sweaty ball series. Cool to start off for the games. And, um... <sighs> I guess we gotta move on to the Sacramento Kings, huh? This shit is disgusting, bro. You niggas just pissed me off. Oh my god, you let him drop 50. I gotta give it up to Curry. That's a great performance. Probably one of the best performances of your life. Never happened again, you know what I'm saying? Especially during the Lakers series. Like, Vando is shutting that down. Facts. But, um, yeah. Gotta give it up to Curry. Kings, just let me down again, brother. Oh my god, it's a bonus. You did nothing this whole series. I'm thinking he's going to pop off the whole game. They want to play good in the first half. De'Aaron Fox was okay to have a bad game. It's just like you came at the wrong moment, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, he was doing good the whole series. It's just like, ah, why now? Like, why? Why? <laughs> We're supposed to kick these niggas out and celebrate. You got Curry saying, light the beam. Everybody gassing. And now they're saying he's the best point guard of all time. You can't make this me riding up. You know, Curry has an argument, I guess. But other than that. I'm going to catch you in the next one.